The scariest night of the year is getting closer, all the ghouls, ghosts, and goblins will be running amok. If you wanted to avoid the hustle and bustle and watch a classic Halloween movie, well you're in luck. Here are the top 10 Halloween movies of all time. Number 10. When Good Ghouls Go Bad, 2001 starring Christopher Lloyd. A new kid in town must drive away ghosts with the help of his zombie uncle. When Halloween decorations begin to mysteriously disappear around town, the boy and his reanimated uncle join forces to find out who is behind the attempt to destroy the residents' enjoyment of the spooky holiday. Number 9. Monster House, 2006. No adults believe three youths' assertion that a neighboring residence is a living creature that means them harm. With Halloween approaching, the trio must find a way to destroy the structure before innocent trick-or-treaters meet ghastly ends. Number 8. Casper, 1995. Casper is a kind young ghost who peacefully haunts a mansion in Maine. When specialist James Harvey played by Bill Pullman arrives to communicate with Casper and his fellow spirits, he brings along his teenage daughter, Cat played by Christina Ritchie. Casper quickly falls in love with Cat, but their budding relationship is complicated not only by his transparent state, but also by his troublemaking apparition uncles and their mischievous antics. Number 7. Beetlejuice, 1998. After Barbara played by Gina Davis and Adam Maitland played by Alec Baldwin die in a car accident, they find themselves stuck haunting their country residence, unable to leave the house. When the unbearable deets is played by Catherine O'Hara and Jeffrey Jones and teen daughter Lydia played Winona Ryder by the home, the Maitlands attempt to scare them away without success. Their efforts attract Beetlejuice played by Michael Keaton, a rambunctious spirit whose help quickly becomes dangerous for the Maitlands and innocent Lydia. Number 6. The Adams Family, 1991. When a man played Christopher Lloyd claiming to be Fester, the missing brother of Gomez Adams played by Raul Julia, arrives at the Adams home, the family is thrilled. However, Morticia played by Angelica Houston begins to suspect the man is a fraud, since he cannot recall details of Fester's life. With the help of lawyer Tully Alford played by Dan Hidea, Fester manages to get the Adams clan evicted from their home. Gomez realizes the two men are conspiring to swindle the Adams fortune and that he must challenge Fester. Number 5. Trick or Treat, 2007. Interwoven stories demonstrate that some traditions are best not forgotten as the residents played by Anna Paquin, Brian Cox, and Dylan Baker of a small town face real ghosts and goblins on Halloween. Tales of terror reveal the consequences of extinguishing a jack-o'-lantern before midnight and a grumpy hermit's encounter with a sinister trick or treater. Number 4. Halloween Town, 1998 Marnie and her kids get a big shock when they follow Grandma home to Halloween Town, and find out they come from a family of witches. The town is the only place where supernatural beings can lead a normal life, but trouble is looming, and on her 13th birthday Marnie not only finds she is a witch, but that she and her family are involved in a fight against the evil that is threatening to take over the world. Number 3. The Nightmare Before Christmas 1993. The film follows the misadventures of Jack Skellington, Halloween Town's beloved Pumpkin King, who has become bored with the same annual routine of frightening people in the real world. When Jack accidentally stumbles on Christmas Town, all bright colors and warm spirits, he gets a new lease on life, he plots to bring Christmas under his control by kidnapping Santa Claus and taking over the role. But Jack soon discovers even the best laid plans of mice and skeleton men can go seriously awry. Number 2. Halloween, 1978. Fifteen years after murdering his sister on Halloween night 1963, Michael Myers escapes from a mental hospital and returns to the small town of Haddonfield, Illinois to kill again. Starring Jamie Lee Curtis, Nick Castle, Nancy Kyes. Number 1. Hocus Pocus, 1993. After moving to Salem, Mass., 
Teenager Max Dennison played by Omri Katz explores an abandoned house with his sister Danny played by Thora Birch and their new friend, Allison played by Vanessa Shaw. After dismissing a story Allison tells as superstitious, Max accidentally frees a coven of evil which is played by Betty Midler, Sarah Jessica Parker, and Kathina Jimmy who used to live in the house. Now, with the help of a magical cat, the kids must steal the witch's book of spells to stop them from becoming immortal. So what did you think of the list? Did I forget any classic thrillers? If I did leave a comment and tell me what movie and why. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel.